Let the games begin. That's the word from New York State. Certain organized youth sports can resume in some regions on July 6th. CBS 2's Carolyn Gussoff reports. Playgrounds are open. Across Long Island, there was a will and a way to open them safely, but steps away. Sports fields are empty, except for family catches and socially distanced instruction. When will organized youth sports resume? The governor is allowing large protests. He's allowing various activities, but we're not allowing one of the safest activities, kids' sports. The governor has answered. We're also opening low-risk youth sports in phase three. Baseball, softball, gymnastics, field hockey, cross-country, and crew green-lighted July 6th for regions in phase three. Two spectators allowed per child. But that has coaches in other sports. I get my body around. Insisting they too can safely play. Cross is not on the list, but yet field hockey is on the list. Show me the science that says field hockey is safer than girls lacrosse. Hempstead Town Supervisor Don Clavin is asking the governor to rethink which sports and let them play ball now. The coaches are ready to do this in a proper manner with the safeguards necessary of hand sanitizer, scanners. They want to do the right protocols and we should give them the ability, but most importantly, we should give our kids the ability to enjoy themselves again. These Garden City athletes taking a swing at the issue. I'm glad that we get this opportunity because uh, a lot of people have it worse right now. I do think it's time. I think it should have done, been done earlier. What we've been doing locally has been working. People have been doing the right thing for the most part. And, uh, you know, a couple of weeks at this point, I'd rather do it right and not have to go back. NASA executive Laura Curran says July 6th isn't a home run, but she'll take it. Kids who've been cooped up for a long time, they need to get out. It's good for their social development, their muscular development, their mental development. And with camps allowed to open on June 29th, but team sports waiting till July 6th, does that mean kids at camp can only play certain sports? Coaches and camps awaiting clearer state guidance. In Long Beach, Long Island, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News.